This is the Negro Ninja. And I noticed that a lot of bitches have been going vegan lately. A lot of bitches have been going vegan lately. And the vegan bitch is a contradictory bitch because the bitch is the reason that we are eating meat in the first place. Bitches are the reason we eat meat in the first place. All God did was tell you to sit your ass down and not play in that particular tree that he told you not to play in. You not only defied him, but you went over there and sucked somebody else's dick that was not your husband's. See, the irony is they started off by eating meat first. You know, they started off by eating meat first. And it was not her husband's dick that was in her mouth first. So these bitches started off eating the meat off of somebody else's plate. You, that shit, it's just real stupid when you think about it. You know, and then they want to sit around and act like none of that shit happened, which is essentially what veganism with hoes is in the first place. It's the equivalent of a hoe that's talking about she's a born again virgin. You know, and then vegan bitches in particular got the most critical shit to say about niggas that eat meat. What that one celebrity hoe saying, you know, and I, I ain't got nothing against it, though. I'm just saying it just to stay consistent. But um, what she say? She don't date men that eat meat because she smelled death on their breath. And you see that type of stuff. They say the most critical shit about people that eat meat. You know, like how to how to save the hole. Got so much shit to say about a hole like she ain't never been a hole before. Five minutes ago, you was a hole that decided to turn your life around because. One particular nigga probably just, you know, stretched you out too much, you, you know. And you just decided that your pussy was wore out. For whatever reason, you were still just a whole five minutes ago and got a lot to say. And then pretend like you ain't never ate meat before when you was the first motherfucker that did it. Which is ironic, because you was the first person. I think, I, they look like whores were the first ones to actually get fucked in the first place, you know. But that's just my theory. But you got to think about this type of stuff. You got to think about this type of stuff. All this is the equivalent of a whore that wants to play with your balls, get your dick hard and say, oh, no, I'm sorry. I don't suck dick. You finna take this dick. But you finna take this dick. And that's how bitches that are vegan have been operating. The whores I've been messing with over the past days all do that same shit. But, you know, that's nothing new. Whores do that in particular, but particularly in them vegan hoes. Particular, particular them vegan, particularly them vegan hoes. Now, um, women are basically responsible for the way the world deals in the first place, and they're trying to act like killing animals is wrong. Like you, you just, you just killing all these little weak animals when they're essentially doing the same thing by trying to play the most kindness type of man for his resources. They're doing the same shit. They're doing the same shit. Trying, let me just prey on this cute little squirrel. This cute little rabbit. The rabbit ain't doing nothing to nobody. And, then, and then this is how sick it is with women. This is how sick it is with women. If a man hunted something, he's just finna throw an arrow at it. Okay, I'm just finna kill this real quick. I'm finna roast it. What a bitch would do is, hey, hey, little bunny. Hey. And it would be a pet bunny, by the way, too. Then you see him boiling in a pot. Like that dumbass movie. Is it called A Thin Line Between Love and Hate? I forgot the name of that movie. And if I'm not mistaken, Robin I mean, Martin was in it. That movie. And you just got to think about this type of stuff. And then um, one thing I noticed is what women do was was like a vegan talking about. So oh, I feel so bad about this. All the animals that has to die for you guys to be fed. Bitch, you the one that's the cause of it because your ass require a restaurant to get fucked. You see what I'm talking about? I'm talking all that shit when they weren't responsible. Half the reason why you got steaks in the first place is because a nigga trying to get his dick sucked. These hoes is crazy. Now do this not remind you of a whore that just talk about third world shit out the blue. I tell you to stop being negative but just oh all the third world countries oh my god there's just so much war. Over in the third world countries. Bitch, there's war in yourself. You at war with yourself and everybody else. 
and you was the cause of that shit. Then talking all that type of shit and then start drama 24-7 with other hoes and then be a home wrecker. Whores like niggas with other bitches already. Ain't got a nerve to try to talk that type of shit. All the world is, it's just the actions of the female. Like everything she did is what the world is. Like everything she did when she defied God is basically echoed. And it's basically a, um, what you call that word? Manifestation of her defiance against the most high that we all got to suffer for it. You know, what about Adam? But it, you can, okay, Adam did it too, but look, if that bitch didn't do it, that would not have happened. So it's still ultimately all her fault, even though he's still, <coughs> he's still taking the blame for it. At least he's responsible for his actions. At least he admitted. A bitch won't even admit that to this day. <coughs> the world is the way it is because stupid men run it. Men always starting wars and shit. No bitch, it's you. And I'm pretty sure half these niggas doing what they are doing just to uh, please your stupid ass. Just to please your stupid ass. You can just look at the way society sees status. Is that not the way a whore thinks herself? You ain't shit unless you're in this, in this position. A woman can't even see what a man is unless he is up here you know so you can be down here but she cannot tell that you are you if you and she still ain't gonna be able to tell you are you if you up there she just can't see nothing other than steps you see what i'm talking about they don't see nothing you know and a brute brute what they say um people that eat meat are brutes no ho that's what you are you are a brute we have brute vision because of you. Like what Adam was saying in the book of Adam and Eve. And when God was describing, I mean, telling him why he can't see off into the distance. You know, like he could see everywhere at first. And then, you know, we got nearsighted. We can't, we can't really see anything but what's in front of us. And they described that as being like a brute. A woman cannot even see beyond not only what's in front of her. She can't even see what's behind what's in front of her. Like she can see somebody put on a mask and just forget who the hell it is when she just saw that nigga put it on. So there is no bigger brute than a bitch then got a nerve to try to be vegan and then call everybody else a brute for wanting a hamburger or um, some chicken nuggets. Negro Ninja, what about the niggas that are vegans? See... It makes more sense for a nigga to not want to eat meat. He didn't want to cause all this shit. Because remember, Adam would not have done this shit if Eve didn't do it. He was like, oh, so you, so nothing happened? You seem to be okay. And this, you know, and this makes me believe that Eve probably didn't even look no different than when she bit the fruit in the first place. Because you would have thought that he would think, why are you in the flesh body, Eve? You know, you would, so, you, you know what I mean? Like, she probably didn't even change that much. But he did. And he noticed that he noticed that shit. It was like, damn, what the hell is this? Ah, ah, skin. And you know, so basically, anyway, it makes more sense for a dude to do it because, you know, he ain't the one that defied God willingly. You know, at first, dudes love animals and stuff. You know, Adam love. He named the animals, so why would he want to eat them in the first place? So yeah, that make more sense for a nigga to be a vegan than a hoe. But the dude got better sense than to just flat out just say, oh, the, you know, at least most dudes. You work with me, though. I got to generalize to prove this point. But, um, you know, they got sense enough to know, well, shit, we in this boat. We might as well row it. Ho tried to get out the boat and try to go on a yacht. 